Okay, everybody, it's Hannah back with another Young Living Essential Oil. Um, so remember, I'm not a medical doctor. Please don't ask me for any medical advice. Always go straight to your doctor with those questions. They're professionals. I'm not. Hopefully, you're here because you're in my upline, downline, crossline, whatever, or you're just looking for some Young Living Essential Oil information. So today, I have Copiaba. So this is labeled for topical and aromatic use because it has a colored label. You can use this one neat, so that means you don't need to dilute it. Um, and this one's really good for pain relief. All pain relief. Um, if you just even have a headache, you can use this one. Like on the back of your neck. Um, it fights inflammation. So that's the main way that it fights pain. So post-workout, if you're sore, you can use this. Um, if you've hurt yourself and you want to reduce swelling, help circulation, get blood to that area, use this. Um, teething, this is supposed to help on your children. You just put a drop on your finger and rub it on their gums. Um, and then as the seasons change, this is good for respiratory support because it's going to reduce the inflammation in your lungs and all that and help you breathe better. So not only is it good for pain support, it's good for seasonal support. And along with that is immune support. So if you want to add this in with some thieves, diffuse it, put it on the bottoms of your feet, whatever. This is just going to give you an extra punch to get through all those icky germs. And this one's also really good for your skin. So add this in as part of your skin care routine. It's not photosensitive, so you could use this in the morning. It's good for acne, wrinkles, aging skin evening out skin tone, all that good stuff. Um, and also it helps with concentration. So it fights brain fog. It's comforting and relaxing, really good to diffuse daily. Um, this one is kind of in the middle range as far as price point goes. There are some oils that are much more expensive and there are some that are much less expensive. So this one's kind of in the middle. Wholesale it's $44.25. Retail that's $58.22 for a 15 milliliter bottle. So this 15 milliliters, not a little five milliliter one. Kind of pricey, but I bought this one right after the starter kit because it was in the old starter kit. So there are lots of recipes online for how to use this one because it was in the starter kit. Um, I think every time a new starter kit comes out, People want you to know how to use the oils that you have together, how they can work together to help you with different things. So this one's included in a lot of those recipes because it's in last year's starter kit. Let me know if you have any questions. Comment what oil you want to see next.